Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm filming this the same day as my Walmart haul. Um, our mail comes really late here and my neighbor knocked on my door again because she was at the, so for the, these three mobile homes, our mailboxes are in the middle of the, so the middle mobile home, right in front of her mobile home, there's three mailboxes. So it's not that far, it's just at the end of my driveway, but a little towards her house. So she was getting her mail and she saw the mailman stop in front of my door and just set the package on my steps. He didn't knock and he just drove away. So I asked her if she has a chance, you know, maybe tomorrow or even the next day, even if she doesn't have a chance to go in, if she could call and tell him, because I'm gonna go in again. This will be the third time I'm complaining. Um, like I said, I told my neighbor, I was like, my swamp cooler is going, my TV's going, going. I was in my bedroom. I didn't even hear my neighbor knock because of all the background noise. I have a fan going on in my room, the TV going on in my room, the TV was in the living room. Like, like why do postmen have to be so lazy to just get out of their truck to set the packages on my back steps? Like, it's so frustrating. If it wasn't for her, I mean, I would have seen it because I'm, I've been waiting for this package. So I've been looking at my front step, but that's not the point. Like, he should just set it on my back step and it wouldn't have to be an issue. So I got two cards. I'm going to start with those. And I got one big box from China. Uh, the first card is from Bargains with Brittany. And when I was walking... Sorry. So I pulled my daughter's tool bench out here so that they could both play with it and there's hammers and stuff. So yeah, so you're going to be hearing a lot of that. Sorry. So when I was walking in from my post, from my mailbox, um, my laundry room is really dark. I didn't have a light on. These glow in the dark and these ones. So she put candy corn on the front and it says, boo, I have an eye on you. And then the back says eek. Sorry, I have to keep popping my ears. I don't know. So, um, so it's from Bargains with Brittany. I sent her a Halloween card. I sent a whole bunch out. Um, if you haven't received one from me yet, comment below and let me know if you would like to receive one. I have extras. Um, I accidentally picked up two. Um, I sent one to Fatima and I almost just mailed her another one because I thought I didn't get her. So if you would like to receive one from me, just let me know and I have no problem sending you a Halloween card. I did send out some more today, so if you're on my list and I didn't get to you, you might be on in that stack today. So she decorated it really cute. Thank you so much, Brittany. You're so sweet. Love the card. Um, she just said, Happy Halloween, hope we're doing good, and we are. So I'll definitely, um, you guys already know what my kids are gonna be for Halloween, but I'll try and do like a little slideshow thing because they do stuff here at the clubhouse for the kids with pinatas, and then we're probably gonna take the kids trick-or-treating. Um, one of the ladies at Dollar Tree was talking to me when I was working, and she asked, um, she came in and bought a bunch of candy and buckets and, stuff like that and um I asked her if she was getting ready if she was having a party or if she was like saving the candy for trick-or-treaters because it was a lot of candy and she said it was saved for pretty much the trick-or-treaters and I asked where is a good place to go because this is our first year last year we just went over by my in-laws but we're gonna go this year around here and I don't know where to go so she was mentioning it to me but anyways I got a card from Elaine um Sour Candy Queen. I sent her a Halloween card as well. So this is the one that she sent me and it says Happy Halloween. Hope it's Abra Abraca Fabulous. Sorry, I'm like stuttering a lot. Thank you so much, Elaine. You're so sweet. Um, like I said, I sent her one. I sent Brittany one and I wasn't doing it to get one in return. I just, it was something that I wanted to do. Um, I know a lot of us on here on YouTube love to receive friend mail and cards and and all that jazz so thank you so much ladies I love those I like I said before I keep every single card I ever get even if it's a piece of paper or a note inside of a box I keep them all
so thank you so much ladies and then this one is from china davis i'm gonna cover up her address but she decorated the box really cute with a bunch of flamingos and cactuses and there's some watermelons and then there's more on the back and then there's this really pretty shiny tape on the side so i'm going to open this up i have no idea what's in here she did tell me that she was sending me another package so let me open this and i will be right back because it's gonna shake the camera while i'm doing that drinking some coffee i have a headache i drink coffee all day even at night doesn't keep me up anymore so people are always like you drink coffee at night how do you go to sleep I could drink a Red Bull and I could pass out. I could drink a cup of coffee that's really, really strong and I'll fall asleep. It just doesn't keep me up. So this thing is jam packed. Like I said, I have no idea what any of this is. I just knew that she was sending me something. I'm trying to look for a card or a note or something, but I don't see anything. So hold on, I'm gonna pull all of this out no idea what those are okay, okay it was all the way at the bottom <laughs> uh, that's fine Thank you so much you're so sweet so she decorated this piece of lemon there's she wrote on the back she just said she pre i sent her some friend mail as a thank you because she kept sending me friend mail now i need to send her some more stuff and oh my gosh there's a lot in here okay so she got me these really pretty stickers with some butterflies on there you get 96 in there those are really pretty i will definitely use those Thank you so much. Oh, I love, I've seen all of these and I just haven't picked them up, but I love these ones. I did see them. I put them back and the last time I went, they were all gone. I actually do bake, so I'm really into it. Um, my dream would be to own my own bakery and it would be called Bon Bon's Bakery, but there is a store in a mall here in California and it's called Bon Bon's and that's not where I got it from. But anyways, I really love this one. Um, it has this little canister with like a coffee cup. It has coffee and tea. It has two cutting boards. It has this fork and a spoon and then it says bakery right here. These are really pretty. Thank you so much. These ones are really cute too. Um, the skull and then it has the peace sign or rock and roll sign, sorry. The unicorn. And then there's the ones with the, sorry, uh, the cactuses on it. Love those ones too. These are really cute. Home, family. Home is where the heart is. And then it has a tree and it says, this is our happy place. Those are really cute. I actually haven't seen these ones. And then I've seen these because I've seen Tony, Creative Chica. She hauled these ones, I believe. Um, it says Rodeo Cowboy. There's a guitar, boots, the hat, pretty much all of it right there. That's so cute. I hauled these ones last time and I think I have two left. I just put one on my sister's package. Um, so love those ones thank you and then she got me more of the letters um, these ones are the pink ones that I got for Valentine's Day that I want to save for a Valentine's DIY and then she also got me the blue and the green so thank you so much China it's so sweet of you you didn't have to go all out and get me a ton of stickers but I really appreciate it I actually need to go through my stickers because there's a lot that I haven't opened and I just need to see if I even want them anymore. They're not the ones that I've gotten in friend mail. They're just ones that I bought in like years ago. So thank you so much. Now there's this one. And it's the Herbal Essence Blue Ginger in the Shower Foaming Conditioner. And my store never got these. I don't think that they will and that's okay. Um, I didn't, I wasn't huge on finding these. I have really sensitive 
a really sensitive scalp and when I use a new shampoo or conditioner um, it's not dandruff it's I get a dry scalp and then when I scratch it that skin it ends up looking like dandruff and it's not I have a dry uh, itchy scalp so I've tried cell and sense and blue and all those and they don't work they make it worse but I've seen these before so I actually did want to try one of these and I think it was the orangish one that I wanted but I couldn't remember but I definitely will try this it's, it smells good so thank you so much really appreciate that then there's this one she got me some Halloween towels and there's this one from Dollar Tree that a lot of people were hauling has the RIP and then the pumpkins and then the cat up there this one that says hang in there with the bats black cats and witches hats and then I have this one already but that's okay thank you so much I don't have any room for them I already have towels out so I'll definitely keep them as extras because my son pulls them down and loves to play with them even though that's not what they're for and then she got me this cute little pen my store has these I've been cutting back on pens I just don't have the room my little watermelon thing that spins you're supposed to use it for like utensils but I put pens in it it's full to the brim I can't fit any more pens in there so but that's okay thank you so much and I can give it to my daughter to play with and use and I don't wear contacts, but these I've seen these. They're really cute. This one says all eyes on me. I eventually want to get contacts again. I had them in high school. They're just a pain, and I would always leave them in, and I would never take them out. And then there's this one with the pretty flowers on it. And then she also got me this little pedicure set. So it has the little brush. It has a mirror, I believe. And then, like, some nail files. I think that's what it is. I should just open it instead of guessing. Okay, it's one of those buffers to get your dry stuff off of your heels or wherever. So, and then it has the brush and some nail files. Thank you so much. I do my own pedicures. Sometimes I do go out and get a pedicure. Um, Cause you know, sometimes you just need that touch and all the extra little stuff that they do and they can actually remove all your stuff and they kind of massage your legs so when my feet are really killing me I go and get a pedicure but I mainly do them here at my house so got one of those by the way I tried that foot mask from Bolero it was weird but it actually made my feet really soft so if you're wondering if it works it did for me it was just weird putting a mask on your foot like the feeling just felt really weird it's not like the salon where they wrap a warm towel on you yeah this was totally different and then she got me one of the little witches that laugh let me tell you a little story here so there's one at Dollar Tree that someone removed the tag and they put it somewhere so that when anybody walks by the witch laughs we finally found it like we could not find it and it was driving me insane. I wanted to just go and find the witch and just like break it because it got really annoying. So I probably won't put batteries in this and like have it do that um, because like I said, it, to me it got really annoying. But I never picked one up, just wasn't huge on it, but I can always add it in my little village or on my bottom tray. So thank you so much for the little witch. And then this one feels heavy. She got me this little heart and it has water and like confetti in it and you can slide a picture in the back right here so there's the heart and there's a star and this one says bff so i'll probably save this one for when me and my bestie meet and we can take a picture together and i'll probably put it in there or i can always put a picture of my kids it doesn't have to be say bff i mean you'll put a picture in there it'll cover it up but just a thought so the next one I had mentioned I needed some more journals or notebooks and she picked up two for me my store hasn't gotten any good ones or list pads that I've been seeing people haul this one says follow your heart it's really pretty I love the spiral ones they're my favorite and then there's this one with this really pretty design 
she also got me some more cards which I've been needing because of the friend mail um, I did get this one before it was way before I started my YouTube channel because um, I was sending like friend mail to my sister and stuff like that so this one has eight in there and it just says hi this one also has eight and it says hello spelled a different bunch of different ways and then this one I have hauled before and you only get six and these ones are thank you and they have fruit so love those thank you so much I've been meaning to pick up some more but I just haven't like I said, I've been just trying to get the things I actually really do need and a few things that I really want. And I'm not trying to go all out anymore. It's hard, especially now that I'm allowed to go in the back and just look and see whatever I want. And yeah, my manager was like, just come in before your shift. And if you want to open a box, you can. And I was like, that, you shouldn't be telling me that. That's dangerous. So she got me some more reusable bags. This one's really pretty. I love the colors of this. I use bags every time we go grocery shopping. I usually like to take one giant one like this to Dollar Tree. But when we go grocery shopping, we usually take a bunch because it's a lot of groceries. And we don't pay for our, we don't like to pay for our bags over here. Because we have to pay for shopping bags over here. They're only 10 cents, but then this one is really pretty too. Absolutely love these. Thank you so much, China. You just outdid yourself with this friend mail. It's you always do. I really, I really appreciate it. So the last thing in here, they are the window decals, which I'm honestly gonna save these for next year. I have way too much Halloween decor hanging up. I'm actually in the middle of another Halloween DIY and I'm actually thinking about not starting it and saving it for next year because I saved it on my Pinterest board um, because I just wouldn't have anywhere to hang it up and there's no point in making it and then just having to carefully store it somewhere so I can just make it next year. But I definitely wanted more and my store was running low and the ones that I wanted I just didn't get them in time. So I'll probably save these for next year for some DIYs because I wanted this one. Of course, everybody was using that one for Hocus Pocus DIYs this year. Love that one. And I saw the bubble, bubble toil and trouble one as a DIY also. Love the little pumpkins. And then, oh, this one's cute. It has a jar of candy corn love this one i probably would put this one on my fridge i probably wouldn't use a diy for that thank you so much i'm definitely going to be getting some stuff for you and like i said i kind of haven't been going out and shopping because i have like two days off well four but like during the week i have two and i usually have appointments and stuff but thank you so much china thank you so much elaine sour candy queen Thank you, Brittany, for the cards. I really appreciate it. China, I will message you, let you know I got your package, even though you emailed me this morning, but I did get it, so I'll let you know. And I will let you know when I get your package out to you. Probably not this week, but maybe next week because I haven't started getting anything for you yet. I think I only have two things. So I definitely wanna get you some more stuff before I send you a package. So that is it for this friend mail video. I don't know when I'm posting it, um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I would love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.